I mean, the new trucks that we're launching now, I mean, uh, on the truck side, the biggest segment has always been the long haulage vehicles. That's where we do the mileage. That's where Scania has always historically have a strong position. So, so will, will it actually come through in that segment as well? Yes, it will. And um, I think Europe will be early out. Um, at the moment, we're thinking of uh, an average sort of tipping point when it starts to make sense for our long haulage customers to invest in, in battery electric vehicles will be somewhere 24, 25, uh, 2024, 2025. And in other parts of the world, maybe in China, it might even be a little bit earlier than that. Uh, in other parts of the world, it will take another 5, 10, sometimes even 15 years uh, before it makes sense, if ever. So um, I would say that uh, it's all about the total cost of operation. And uh, as we see the battery cell prices coming down, uh, we see also electricity prices in certain markets uh, coming down. Uh, and of course, then in many countries also the taxation of, of the fossil fuels is, is uh, adding on to the cost. Uh, the curves are, are meeting and, 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 and that's when it makes sense for our customers. So we are preparing ourselves to see electrification as, as a natural part of our modular system at Scania. It's basically that you should be able to build whatever truck you want and, and you either do it with a conventional combustion engine, hopefully then running on biofuels, or you choose to go for an electric uh, vehicle. And then, of course, hopefully driving then on uh, renewable energy.